What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. Today we're opening this Japanese structure deck thing. There's all kinds of stuff in it. Not just structure decks, there's five booster packs of the original sets. I can't remember, they're called like volume one through three. It's gonna be awesome. The giveaway for this video, I'll be giving away an entire Exodia set and a secret rare blue eyes from CT14. That's a pretty epic giveaway. All you have to do, like the video, be subscribed, and let me know what you think about this Japanese product. And if you guys want to check out, if you want to give away, check out the community tab, and let's get into it. This is going to be a pretty cool opening. So let's go ahead and crack this thing open. Uh, I can't read Japanese, obviously, so um, <laughs> we're just going to be figuring out what's in here. We're not using a background today because this thing is huge, so if I use a background, it would have been falling off the back. So I'm going to do my best to show you guys. There's the Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. I can't really give you guys the entire thing very well but i'll try and show you guys what's on here so let's do a quick check okay let's open this thing up let's get to that promo ultimate rare blue eyes ultimate dragon that sounds redundant saying ultimate so many times the condition on this thing was amazing though so it's kind of a shame i had to open it but you know how it goes you know how it goes structure deck here we go how do you open this sucker there we go it's at the top okay open it up like that oh it's everything's falling out it's supposed to go this way Oh, sick. So this is where, okay, you get the Dark Paladin structure deck. That is super cool. Dark Paladin structure deck and the Guilford the Lightning structure deck. These are like mint condition decks. Wow, that is super cool. Okay, we'll go over those a little bit more in a second. You also get the super old sleeves. I'm not sure when this released, but it was a long time ago because these are super old decks. That is really cool. And then finally in here you get the packs, the volume one through five. So these are like the original thing, the original packs. Like you can get ulties in there. Then you have, uh, what is what is all this other room for? Okay, so we got uh, this. There you go. If you guys speak Japanese, that you can read this. Don't know what it says, but uh, let me see if there's anything else in, in back here. There's a really nice presentation of this box. Oh, the promo. Don't forget the promo. How do I get this thing out of here? Look at this, guys. Yeah, it's just, it's just it slid in there. Fortunately, the the thing is old enough that I could just rip the part off the back, the little window. All right, so we got it all opened up. I put the background back because we're ready to go now. We can uh, just look at everything, but I ripped the whole window off so we can get this card out, hopefully in nice condition. This, this is scary. All right, we have a Blue Eyes Ultimate. Oh, <laughs> it's bent up anyway. All that effort for nothing. Oh, it's even got a ding. Man, that's a bummer, because look at this card. Wow, that is a sweet card. I'm definitely going to keep this one anyway. Put it in the binder. Definitely an epic card. Ultimate Rare Blue Eyes. I have no idea. Blue Eyes Ultimate. I don't, know, I don't really know what this goes for. They just came out with another one of these in the recent Prismatic God set. They have the new Ultimate Rare. It looks a little bit different. But wow, does that look good. That's a sweet card. So that's a pretty cool promo to get. Then you get these nice sleeves. We checked these out earlier. That's pretty cool to get those. I mean, just straight up old school. Who doesn't remember this like texture? We had a bunch of these in the United States as well. The structure decks, I'm, I don't know. Should we open these? I don't know if we should open these. They're so nice like this. I mean, just look at that. Dark Paladin Volume 2. We got structure deck. Maybe we'll just open the packs. I mean, that's really what, that's really the exciting part anyway, right? We've got the first volume one through five. We definitely need to take a pick of this. This would be pretty nice for the thumbnail. I mean, just check that out. Duelist Legacy Volume 1, Volume 2, 3, 4, and 5. So can we pull something crazy? We can pull like Ultimate Rares in here. I don't remember exactly which ones. We pulled that Blackluster Soldier. If you guys have not seen that video, check it out. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's just open these up. Volume 5. Hopefully the packs are... I mean, the pack is a little bit bent, but I think the cards are probably going to be fine. We'll see. Let's see if I can preserve this pack. Because I don't think I even... I might not even own one of these opened oh okay that's not gonna be that bad if we can just do this if we pull it down like this that's fine it's okay oh i ripped it okay as long as the front's good that's what we really care about all right first pack are they okay they're a little warped that's okay though that's okay if they're warped a little bit warped we got a uh dragon it's not treasure it's like a can't remember Super Rejuvenation, that's cool. Drop Off, gotta love it. <laughs> Woodland Sprite, no! Okay. no! And what is this? 
I don't know what that is. That's the, the guy from Pharaonic Guardian, but I don't know what this trap card is. I have no idea what that is, to be honest. Okay, that's a cool first pack. It's really tough to hit foils in these, so I'm, if we hit like one, that'd be really cool. Ultimate Rare, obviously, we're going to lose our minds. It doesn't matter what it is. That's going to be insane. So let's go to number four. Duelist Legacy Volume 4. I can't remember what's in what. I can't remember what is has the good stuff. I think it's weird. The, the stuff originally is weird. It's not like Blue Eyes and stuff. Blue Eyes is in Spell of Mask, I think. Ultimate Rare. So it's not in any of these volume ones. Or at least the Ultimate Rare is not. It's always like, I think Mask Beast is one of them in one of the sets or something like that. Oh, we got some uh, stuff on the back already. Okay, let's fix this pack up. Let me know if you guys like these Japanese openings. They are pretty fun. They're, I just don't know what to expect from them because I don't know too much about them. So we got Castle of Dark Illusions, the classic of the 1920, or the 920, 1930. This guy's name is like Yazu something or something like that. I feel like that. Oh, crap. Do we have something back there? Let's try not to spoil it. Hourglass of Courage. I remember this one. I remember it's something about doubling and then halving its attack. I can't remember. Okay, let's do it like this. We've got a Dream Clown. That's a cool card. Okay, what's up next? I'm, I'm getting nervous. This looked like it might have been something. Oh, a Command Knight. We got a Super Rare. That's pretty cool. So the back, unfortunately, has dots on it. That's really strange. So it is a Command Knight. That is really awesome. We got a Super Rare. I have no idea what this is worth. DL4. Duelist Legacy. Yeah, Duelist Legacy. That's right. Okay, a Super Rare to go with our Ultimate Rare. Unfortunately, the Ultimate Rare is damaged. So that's what happens even when you open stuff in great condition from this long ago the chances of it being in good condition itself like the actual cards is pretty low but that's okay so we got a foil we can't really complain now we're just hunting for an ultimate rare or something crazy or a see the secret rares look so good the parallel like super parallel or whatever it's called i can't remember secret parallel or something like that okay also, don't forget, guys, we are going to open up all six 2005 tins when we hit 60,000 subs. So make sure you guys subscribe. That's going to be pretty awesome. I can't wait for that. So we're at over 58,000 now. So that is amazing. That is incredible. Go ahead and do it if you guys want to get to 60 quicker. I appreciate it. Because a ton of you guys are watching as I cringe, cringely open this and are not sub. So go this? ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Here we go. Minor Goblin Official. Why in the world do I know that? Michizuri. We got a s attack and receive? Attack and receive, right? Gamble. We're gambling right now. I don't think this is something. I feel like it's not. Oh, it's just a common. You're not even guaranteed a rare. I forgot about that. Yeah, that's why super rares are super tough. Look at this centering, though. That's terrible. Skull Invitation, by the way. Okay, two more packs, two more chances, two more gambles. We've got a volume two. Duelist Legacy. Can we get something crazy? Can we do it? Unweighed volume packs. Don't. It's hard to find these days. Japanese packs in general are just super rare. Oh wow, I just annihilated that one. So, uh, so much for keeping that. <laughs> just right down the middle. Okay. We've got a Mammoth Graveyard. Always a nice card. Oh, this is, a, this is an alt art. An OG art. I can't remember what it is though. It's a lot different, that's all I remember. Somebody read that for me. Let me know. Tyhone. Classic from LOB. Oh, this. Something bug. I can't remember what it is. And. Oh, look. It's our friend, the Armored Zombie. Uh, check out that great armor he's got on. That's great. Yeah, the Armored Zombie. He made it into the video. So we started off hot. We got a rare and a super. Like, that's really good, apparently, for these packs. You don't even get a rare in all the packs. Final pack, Volume 1. I don't even know what the ulti is, the secret, but it's got to be something cool, right? I mean, it's got to be. Let's see. Was this the first ever pack? Like, I don't even know. This could have been the first ever pack, for all I know. Volume 1. Okay. Here we go. Let's pull something on the final pack. I don't know what this is. Something about stealing. Mangurayu ran. I don't know this one either. Not sure. You guys let me know in the comments. What is it? Kisatai. I think it's Kisatai, right? And 
Harpy's brother, or aka Sky Scout, the new name. So we started off really good. The finish a little bit anticlimactic. But we did pull a super rare in this video. We pulled a Command Knight. That's pretty cool. We pulled the ultimate rare uh, promo. Very awesome. And also we have these awesome decks. I just don't want to break these open for no for no reason, to be honest. Because I don't know what's in them. May I don't know. Maybe we'll open them at some point. But I feel like, I mean, this Dark Paladin just needs to stay in there, right? You know what I'm saying? Because I know he's like $8 if you take him out. So he's not much. And this card's probably even less. But those are really, really beautiful. Really awesome packs, really awesome like product there. So I'm, I'm glad we opened it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe. We have more epic videos coming up. We're trying to hit 60K subs, so hit that subscribe button. Turn on the notification bell. And don't forget to enter the Volcanic Doomfire giveaway on the community tab if you guys haven't done that. That will be announced pretty soon. And that's it for today. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh. Elemental Hero Dark Bright Boom! Oh. <laughs>